Staying in Fairfield, the driver targeted and is shot at over road rage on I-80. Police say a woman is lucky to be alive after a reckless driver followed her off the interstate and shot a bullet through her driver's side door. Pretty wild story. CBS 13's Anna Giles is live in Fairfield with how police tracked down the suspect, Anna. Yeah, police say the victim was making a right turn at this intersection behind me when she was shot. She didn't realize it until she got home and found a bullet in her steering wheel. The bullet missed the driver by inches. These photos show the exact spot where a gunshot went through a woman's car as she tried to get away from a road rage suspect Sunday night. This could have been an extremely tragic situation. Fairfield police say the suspect followed her off of I-80 onto the Waterman Boulevard exit, then shot at her. Turns out, police say someone else reported this same suspect earlier in the day, and they had a full license plate number. Said that they had an individual who was driving recklessly. They thought maybe he was intoxicated, DUI, um, felt like they were being very aggressive. Officers used the city's brand new, just installed camera and tracking system to pinpoint the suspect's car. We have 38 cameras throughout the city, strategically placed them to help us solve crimes and to prevent crimes. The suspect was tracked to Beck Avenue and found sitting in his car with a gun in plain sight. Officers were able to arrest him without any issues. They remind people this can happen to anyone, anywhere. Terry Hamilton says he stays safe to protect his passengers. With her in the car now that I'm older, I just I ignore it. I do my best to ignore it and just let it pass. Police say that's the safest thing you can do. You might feel that it's prudent to say something or honk your horn. Be careful, that might get you into something that you don't want. Yeah, and police say everyone involved in this case did the right thing. It's about being a good witness, noticing that license plate number or the suspect description. And that's what led to a speedy conclusion to this case. All right, very scary. Thanks, Anna.